Your name is Jim. Yeah, this is Joe. What? You're just in time for the day and you want to have lunch? Well, sure, honey. Listen, we're starting a ladies day here and I have to interview a new instructor, but I'll make it quick. Right, I'll meet you there in 20 minutes. Yeah, honey. Of course I love you. Hey, hey, uh, who is this? <laughs> oh, darling. I was only kidding. And it was you all along. Right. Come in, it's open. Come in. I see you're a swinger. <laughs> yes, honey. Uh, I'm the new instructor you sent. The name is Miss Jones. Geraldine Jones. How do you do? I'm Joe Neal. Uh, charmed, I'm sure. <laughs> Broadway Joe. Playboy of the Western world. <laughs> Woo! Oh, ah, you've heard of me, huh? You must be a football fan. No, I'm not a football fan. I'm a man fan. <laughs> well, we have to make this a short interview, Geraldine. Geraldine? Who said you could call me Geraldine? <laughs> you don't know me. Ooh, you're a devil, ain't you? Uh, would, would you mind hanging this up for me? <laughs> Be careful, it ain't. It ain't dead yet. He tried to bite me this morning. <laughs> I've never seen a fur like that. Well, it's 10% beaver and 90% Dacron. Chilla works for a guy who owns a Dacron farm. Ah, oh, you get your own drip dry fur coat. Yes, honey. During the summer, I keep it in the freezer. Well, listen, do you have any references? References? I don't need any references. Well, have you had any experience in physical culture? Honey. <laughs> Honey, the only culture that I know about is physical. Well, look, uh, let me see what you know about this equipment. Yes, what I know about the equipment. <laughs> Don't get behind me. You just, you just stay up here where I can watch you. Yeah, I know about them quarterback sneaks. Uh, generally, when I conduct a class, I give them a little pep talk first. Now I say, girls, girls, we all shut up and listen. Now, you all know why we're here. So let's cut out the faking and get on with the shaking. Ooh. Honey, if Killer knew about this. This is what, this is what you call a backfield in motion. Of power failure, I teach the girls to do this without the machine. <laughs> However, we won't get into that right now. Come on, honey. Look, can we do this some other time? Do what some other time? I'm only gonna give you a massage. <laughs> you better watch it, Joe. <laughs> Bashful, honey, you're just another body to me. Well, I'm not bashful, but I have to go out. Honey, you've been out all season. <laughs> oh. uh, what's the matter? I got a bad rib. Honey, I'm working on your neck. Uh, oh! Now what? 
I got a bad shoulder, too. You got a bad shoulder, a bad rib, two bad knees, and a broken wrist. Honey, you should have left before her husband got there. <laughs> The name is Miss Jones. Now I'm not gonna tell you again. You must not have heard about Killer. Killer? <laughs> Who's Killer? Who's Killer? Honey, he marched down the football field of my heart <laughs> and tore down the goalposts of my love. Friend, huh? That's right, honey. He's my number one draft choice. <laughs> and the army's looking for him, too. <laughs> uh, turn over, honey. You done on this side. Okay. I really hate to keep Darlene waiting. You devil, you... I saw the way you huddled with Ann Margaret in that picture. You saw it? I saw that! What, what'd you think of my acting? Sir Lawrence Olivia. <laughs> uh, stay where you are, honey. I'll get it. We're not finished yet. Touchdown. <laughs> Hello? Darlene. Uh-huh, Joe's here. Uh, he can't come to the phone now. He's flat on his back. <laughs> Who am I? That's none of your business. If I'd have wanted to talk to you, I'd have called your house. <laughs> she got a lot of nerve. Who am I? Well, you've got to ruin it with Darlene for me. She's not your type, honey. You need a woman with fire. <laughs> Woo! Don't fight the feeling. <laughs> Why don't you have lunch with me? What? <laughs> me have lunch with you? With your reputation? <laughs> I'd love to. <laughs> but uh, I better check with Killer first. Oh, well, Killer doesn't have to know about this. He don't, huh? Oh. Mm -hmm. Killer don't have to know about this. Well, honey, if Killer caught me having lunch with you without asking, Next year, two of us will be out for the season. Well, listen, if you change your mind, I'll be downstairs in the Time Out Cafe. Yes. I'll be in the booth. In the booth. In the back. In the back. In the corner. In the corner. In the dark. In the dark. <laughs> Tables, get the dime and come to the phone. Killer, I was just talking to Broadway Joe. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, Joe invited me to lunch. He said he'd be in the Time Out Cafe. I told him I had to check with you first. He said it probably wouldn't make any difference to you. He said you probably wouldn't even want to know about it at all. I told him I better ask anyway. He said he'd be in the booth, in the back, in the corner, in the dark. <laughs> yes. You're gonna meet him. That's right, in the booth, in the back, in the corner, in the dark. Okay, honey, now call me from the police station. Well, there goes Joe's legs again. <laughs>